For the first quarter um, of the year 2019 at the new year I want to say thank you for being here thank you for returning this year 2019 I'm not sure why I'm wearing my glasses just uh, a habit okay so um, for you Aquarians let's look and see what's happening for the Aquarians for the first three months of the year 2019 I want to say thank you so much please remember to cross watch um, and um, cross watch but also subscribe subscribe because this new year a lot of new changes a lot of new things is going to be happening so subscribes and uh, um, we are going to be aligning ourselves with positive energy vibration um, this year the first three months with the general energies is not one of the best for you um, Aquarians in your air signs so be aware and enlightened with that energy okay so let's look and um, focus on what is going to be happening please remember that this is always an extended reading so for the extended reading please use the link below and it will take you to my website and you can receive the rest this um, is going to go to 30 minutes so um, this is there is a, the extended reading is really a lot okay so let's look we call it we already call in all the positive beams of life so um, please show us what is going to be happening for the three first months of 2019 for um, the Aquarian Sun Moon and Rising so in January you have this energy I'm sorry I gotta put my glasses <laughs> in January we have the lovers that is going to be happening for you Aquarians the energy of the lovers that is coming up in January so this is wonderful um, this is because um, um, there is going to be information coming out about the lovers that is coming up in January because the general readings go back and check out the general readings um, the general readings have the energy of judgment judgment with the energy of the lovers okay so there is going to be a judgment call over um, a situation that has to do with a love relationship okay so judgment is going to be coming out over a relationship that has to do um, with um, um, whatever the situation is listen to me ladies and gentlemen it's going to be a judgment call okay judgment over the lovers okay I'm not seeing any marriage it's going to be information that is going to be coming out about you or your partner so there is going to be a judgment call about your relationship where you could be finding out that your partner hasn't been honest to you and your partner was seeing someone else but whatever is happening it's coming from out of um, the year ending coming into the month of January information about your partner it could be a work situation we are going to be look to see who or what because this is going to be happening okay so um, what is going to be um, happening for February let's look at February 2019 and see what is going to be happening for you guys February 2019 we have the energy of the hair event now the energy of the air event is an earth energy so you're dealing with earth and water so some secrets about the organization is going to be coming out in the month of February whatever this organization is it could be an organization that you are working in or you are affiliated to but some lies and secrets is going to be coming out about this organization the energy of the eye princess is here and the 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 um, the, this this organization so it could be that secrets about government institutes see um, secrets about uh, 
insurance company secrets about hospitals secrets about the medicine world secrets but it's it's something secrets uh, secrets about organization it's going to be happening secrets about organization is going to be happening a lot of secrets in the month of February about organization is going to be coming out and you need to align yourself with these energies so for you Aquarians you really need to align yourself with this energies because a lot of secrets about organization is going to be coming out in the month of February okay so this is wonderful this is um, positive because uh, go back and look at the general energies because there's actually um, no support for you Aquarians with the general energies because what is transpiring is that there's a lot of stuff that was happening there is a lot of stuff that was happening so um you need to be aligned and ready with these um, situation because you're working with the energy of the general energies but also the energies that you yourself that is affecting you as an Aquarian okay so whatever organization it could be your company it could be a hospital that you're dealing with um, it could be different align alignment of things that is really that information secrets because um, the first two months of January it's going to be secrets coming out about organization and institutes that people wasn't uh, aware of okay it's like lies and some lies and deception in an organization that people weren't aware of okay so let's look at the month of um, March the month of March we have the energy of the chariot and this is beautiful the energy of the chariot comes up for the month of March and this is going to be wonderful this is um, um, I'm very positive because you you guys are going to be um, moving away okay you could be moving in the month of March you could decide to leave an organization in the month of March you could be um, divorcing because the energy of the lovers uh, the air event and um, the movement so you could decide to divorce after hearing about um, something that has transpired with your relationship some of you could decide to be um, um, turning your back moving away from an organization or a situation okay so some lies and deception um, has come to out about your um, your your partner or about um, a work that you have contracts it could be business partners it could be your husband or wife or your long-term um, relationship some lies and deception um, came out in the month of January um, uh, in the month of February you decide um, after hearing what has transpired that you're letting go of this person and you're moving on okay um, you, you decide I no longer want to be aligned with this person whoever this person is because of some lies and deception that has transpired okay so um, this is good this is positive because what this is um, basically doing is that this is aligning yourself this is um, you taking back your power and said hell no I'm not going to be doing this okay you are taking back your powers and you're saying no I'm not going to be doing this hell no I um, I'm going to be choosing a better part in my life this is where um, you have decided that um, um, life is too precious to be wasted on someone who's been so deceptive um, to you okay and and, and this is um, this is very very positive it's really very positive because you're taking back your power by saying no I will not um, live with someone who have deceived me like that you are taking back your power and you're saying no I am um, because this is the year of you aligning yourself this is the year of the hangman okay it's a year of the hangman oh please people it's a year of the hangman and this is the year of you aligning yourself with the right um, positive energies in your life I hate this when people are just banging all and that's why I hate to live in um, a tinder so this the energy of the hangman is what is the energy of the year so what you're seeing and what is transpiring is that this is a year of a lot of secrets are going to be coming out you're going to be finding out things about yourself you're going to be connecting with yourself you're going to be aligning with the energies with yourself but you're also going to be finding out about a lot of secrets a lot of lies deception it can be deception from um, institutes the organization but it can be deceptiveness from your partner 
okay it can be things that you weren't not aware of that your partner was doing and this information is coming out of the year coming in this year so it is a year of deceptiveness so you need to understand that it is a year of deceptiveness so you need to understand that the energy of the moon is going to be your outcomes of this quarter so secrets and lies are going to be coming out so let's see what is um, um, the energy that is going to be affecting you guys because whenever the energy of because uh, obviously um, the year the general energy of the year is showing you that the first two months a lot of surprise um, a lot of surprises is coming out in the first two months January and February of this year a lot of surprises and what is affecting you air sign people is that there is no supporting energies for you air sign people it's water 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 and judgment call with the lovers then we're seeing the energy with the eye princess secrets are going to be coming out secret organization secrets information secrets about you going because obviously um, a divorce some people are going to decide I'm leaving you in the month of uh, um, in the month of uh, March whatever you decide to do it is the best thing to do in the month of March whatever you decide to do is the best thing to do what we're seeing here is that it's all about the connection of two people okay it's all about and even if you connect with an organization you're working for an organization you have connect because you have signed a contract with this organization so um, it's gonna be in the personal life with um, you're finding some finding out something about your husband or wife or um, and you're deciding that you're going to be divorcing and in March you're going to decide to move on and it is saying yes move on because there is no and it can be um, you're working in an organization and you found out some deception and lie and you're going to decide I'm, I'm cutting off this organization and move on um, it can be another um, situation where you have a business partner and you have found out uh, end of December coming in uh, this new year of January some lies and deceptiveness and you decide um, to handle relationship and in March you're going to be moving on so this first quarter is the quarter of the moon what is the moon how does the moon affect you? the moon affect you in the sense that this could be showing you um, that you're living with uh, the enemy that you're sleeping with the enemy this is this, the, the, you know and your best friend is always your worst enemy and this is so true your best friend is always your worst enemy so this is what you need to understand and this is how you need to understand how things work and how um, people and situation is because the same person you're sleeping with is stabbing you in the back whenever he goes he or she goes out to sleep with someone else so um, your best friend is basically your worst enemy and this is what we need to understand and this is how we need to transpire and this is how we need to too because obviously someone who you um, honestly um, um, it could be a child it could be a, 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 a good friend whether a man or a female but this person who you have been friends with for a very long time is going to let you down this is someone you can see um, you have been um, you know walking together in the in this and it's as